Hey Jane, how are you doing? Hi, good Joe. Good. Just got a problem for you though. Another problem? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Oh, well that's alright. <laughs> We're here to help. That's great. So what I need to do is I need to try and get um, contact with my students, with them being online. Great. Well, look, the easiest way to do that is to use a tool called Collaborate Ultra, and that's in Canvas. So if I get you to log on to Canvas. Well, you're actually logged in already, it asked me. Please uh, click on your course that you want to create the Collaborate session for. Right, this is your Canvas course shell. I see you've got a bit of work to do in this one. Yeah. Okay, what we're going to do, we're going to go to the... Um, Collaborate Ultra link, if you just click on that in your menu items. And what this tool does, it enables us to schedule a online virtual classroom session with your students. So if you click on the Create Session button, and the first thing we need to do is give the session a name. So I think Jane1234, and again call it the um, date. We don't really uh, worry about uh, the Anonymous style, and we don't use that tool. You can invite anyone to this Collaborate session, a guest lecturer, even if they're not part of the RMIT community. Right. Just copy the actual guest um, link, and you can email it to that person. They click on the link, and they can access the session. But um, next we have is the event details. So by default, it'll always choose today's time and date. So what you can do is you can choose, uh, if you want to select it for tomorrow, just click on the calendar that you want to choose and select the time you want to choose as well. And just click out of there. By default, it will choose an hour session. You can make it a half an hour or you can make it as long as you like. Sometimes we have a no end, an open session, which can be open for the whole semester, which means students can drop in and drop out of that session anytime they like. If you want to repeat the session, for example, if you want to have it every week or every day, you can click on the repeat session button and it gives you the option to repeat it weekly, daily, or whatever else you like. And you can choose your time and dates from that as well. However, we don't want to repeat this weekly or daily, so if you uncheck that button, and if you scroll down and if you just maximize the um, session settings there, and look, it's always good to click the button. I click the box that says allow recording downloads. That means the students can actually download the recordings after the session as well. So it's pretty handy. Very useful, is that one? Yeah, it's, it's, it is useful. It's good for students to be able to um, consume the content offline or whatever they want to do. And if you save that, that means the session now will be booked into our Collaborate recordings. And we have it there. We have Jane1234. When you want to access the session, you go into your Canvas course shell. You click on the Collaborate Ultra link. You go to the session and just click on that. And then you click on Join Session and that will enable you and the students to join the session. Okay, Jane, before you start the session, you need to make sure that the microphone and that the video camera are all working. And how we do that, we click on the button over here on the right-hand side. You click on the, um, the gear wheel, which will enable you to check your um, audio. If you click on the first one, set up your camera and microphone. Okay, and here it has um, the default microphone. You want to click on the drop-down arrow and choose your headset. If you put on your headset, and if you do a test. One, two, three, one, two, three. And that appears to be working fine. So yes, it's working. I'm just gonna ask you now for your, see if your video is working. And your video looks like it's working okay. So select yes. Great. And you're almost all ready to go. Before you start, you want to record your session so students can access everything. So if you click on the um, button on the top left-hand corner, you click on Start Recording, and you notice there's a little red light there in the camera. That tells you now that it'll capture everything that you have on your screen. Okay, so you're all set to go, Jane. I am. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Good luck with it. Thanks very much.